Okay, so what it is, this is a very quick test with a nano mic that I've just built for the pocket. <clears throat> now, obviously it's very, very dark. It's really late at night. Um, I've just basically built it and I thought, well, I'll run outside and do a quick test on it. So this is by no means a picture test. This purely is just audio. So basically what it is, this microphone is something that I put together whereby I kind of just butcher like two or three other components and basically shorten down what is effectively an, a lavalier microphone, but make it as small as possible. So the body goes straight to the TRS socket and then just wire in a Primo EM172 capsule into that. And that particular capsule is what's being used on um, the lavalier that I recently did a demonstration of, which was the Clippy EM172 by Mike Booster. So the same capsule that goes in that. <clears throat> the other thing I've got at the moment is a lavalier dead cat on this little arrangement, uh, only because it is breezy. So it's gonna be interesting to hear um, how much of the breeze this is going to knock out. Now the thing with this, it's such a discreet microphone system. I think it's going to be a brilliant option for an external solution for the Clippy because it'll basically replace its internal mics as it were um, with something that's better with more bass response and such and generally more sensitive. It's just a better capsule all around this. So basically, this is me very first test with it. Um, and I think as the camera lost me, uh, that, anyway, it's not a picture test. Now, that's me full arms length away there. So that's gonna give us a very good idea as to how this is sounding. Now, the other thing as well with this, because it's hanging directly underneath and it's just hanging off the mic adapter. I mean, it doesn't add hardly any, any weight at all. It's, a, it's literally a matter of grams there. So, doesn't add any big weight so it's not going to strain any of the connections whatsoever but because of the placement of it it just means that you can actually hold the pocket better because the way you would want to hold this you know the pocket naturally is you would likely be covering one or both of the microphones if you try to hold it with a with a nice firm grip well this allows you to hold it with a firm grip but without interfering with the microphone as well okay yeah so anyway um this was just a basic preliminary test here uh, i might have put this live um on the dji uh, forum if it is it's not actually it'll be linked to my youtube channel but it's not going to be live on my youtube channel because what i'm going to do is do a brief how to to build this and then uh, a better demonstration of it <laughs> in the daytime when um you know when, when you know yeah there's a better picture and such also as well i will have just put a bit of a limiter on this as well in post on the audio just so i can gain it up and get it as like healthy on the output as i can okay so yeah that's about it so if any if i do actually put this on the uh, on the dji forum i'd be very interested to hear what uh, people think of uh, you know how it sounds and such anyway yeah that's uh, that'll do for now bye bye